Konnichiwa everyone, it's me, Jaren Lefebvre again. So, today, I'm gonna show you spiders. Spiders in my own basement. Yeah, so, apparently, I have a handful of spiders uh, in my basement, uh, all around where I write. And, uh, oh, sorry. So, yeah, this is the area where I write right here, and there's, like, two big spires uh, in between. Here, I'll show you. So, this one spider is hidden behind these boxes, but look all the bugs has caught recently. So, as you can see, it's not a bad thing to have spiders hang around uh, in your house as long as they're out of your way and like in the corners because they can catch other bugs for you and look it's they even catch uh, hobo spiders which have venomous bites which well is a very good thing we don't want those in the house so yeah this one has caught at least three hobo spiders and one beetle and uh, a small centipede I don't know if you can see the spider in there, but it's somewhere in there. And there's another one directly underneath my writing table. It's hiding behind that table right there. But yeah, this is where I put my feet and the f there's a spider hanging around by my feet all the time. So as you can see, this one has caught a couple spiders too. A couple hobo spiders right there laying on the ground couple corpses oh yeah and that tissue right there is to was i put that there because i discovered that there were hobo spiders sneaking in through a hole right there so i had to cover it up somehow oh and by the way these are the books that i'm writing i can provide a website link for about the reflection series uh, for anyone who's curious in my in my videos uh, description below anyways moving on and uh, those weren't the only spiders nearby look up see that's what the spider looks like and as you can see i think it also has a hobo spider right at its mouth that's a pretty small one yeah very small need to do that and uh, if we look around here there's also another one yep right there and that also has a hobo spider in its mouth uh, yeah wow that's a big spider but at least they're completely harmless. Those ones with the that look like dandy long legs. And there's another one down here. Just yep, there. That's like the fifth one. Yeah. Hasn't really caught much, but I'm gonna keep it so that it can catch more bugs for me. And there's another well. It's hidden right now, but there's another spider here, and you can see that there is quite a bit of spider web around this area. I think she is hiding behind this bookshelf right here. Yeah, but yeah, there's quite a bit of web. And uh, right here in the corner of the stairs, there's a web here too. I don't think you, the spider is there still. I mean, it used to be there, but... It, it does do a good job catching more hobo spiders and preventing them from going up these stairs towards uh, the upper part of our house. But yeah, spiders are not all that bad uh, or scary. I mean, depending on the spider. They're really good at catching bugs for you and other dangerous spiders for you. And, uh, well... <laughs> It's their free pets. What's to complain about that? Well, 
thank you for watching this video. That's all I wanted to share with you for today. Sign our for now.